Welcome to Ucanic. Today here on Ucanic we have a 2016 Mazda CX-5. This Mazda CX-5 has the 2.5 liter Skyactiv technology motor. So we are going to go over how you would change your spark plugs on this vehicle. So to start with you'll pop the hood and be able to support the hood up. Uh, disconnect the negative battery cable because we are dealing with the spark plugs and just a good practice. And now with that all done, then we can go ahead and just pop this cover off. This is just held on with some rubber grommets. And we can pop and put that to the side. So here are um, coil. We have the individual coils per cylinder. One, two, three, and four is your cylinder order. And then we'll remove the four screws and they hold the coils in. And then undo these four electric connectors. These connectors, you just need to press down and pull backward. Get them out of the way. And now we'll remove those four number eight screws. And now we can remove the coils themselves. And now we can proceed to remove the spark plugs. Spark plugs are a size 14. So we're going to remove the spark plugs and we're looking at them to see that there's hopefully not a major variation between them. They all look pretty good. Cylinder 3 here has some white substance on it, but otherwise Looks like they've got pretty good uh, burn factor. So now we're ready to put our new spark plugs in. These are our new spark plugs by the spark plugs respect for the vehicle. Um, you'll check that your gap is at 0.44. And this one, they come from the manufacturer pre-gapped. Now you may get ones that don't have this uh, protective sleeve on it that will protect it while it's in travel to potentially not get bent, but it still doesn't hurt to check at least one of them to make sure but if you're missing that cover then you'll want to make sure that you check them so that the gap isn't been smashed down so you use a spark plug socket and the difference with the socket is it has a little rubber grommet in there that will hold your spark plugs they also make magnetic ones so that they don't just fall straight down into the hole and damage the uh the electrode there as well as you know setting the uh messing up your gap. All right, so we have those all in hand tight. Now we'll torque them to spec, which is 14 foot pound. And what we're doing here is just making sure that we crush that that washer there and we don't want to over tighten them and mess up the threads they've all been torque spec now we can install the um, coils either if you're reusing the old coils or if you're putting new ones in either way it doesn't hurt to put just a teeny bit of dielectric grease in there to give it a better make sure we have a good electrical connection all 
for longer life. Now we will put the four bolts that hold the coils in. Just snug. They don't need to be crazy tight. They're just uh, an extra barrier to make sure that these don't move and come out. Now, well, snap all the electric connectors back onto the coil pack or the coils and then go ahead and put your protective cover back on lining up the um the grommet holes there and snapping that into place and so that's how you would change your spark plugs on your 2.5 Sky Active motor on a Mazda CX-5. Thanks for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.